The sun is set and the king of the modifieds at South Boston Speedway is over. I'm Bob Dillner, he's Jeff Button, a kid, and only his third start is the king of the modifieds. How much of a surprise is that? That was a big surprise because all day long, Matt Hirschman, I mean, going into this, I've seen the comments, I've seen all the talk. Oh, just give it to Matt, go ahead and sign the check. Listen, if anybody's been keeping up with the Smart Tour here lately, Matt Hirschman has been beat. Superman does bleed. And these two youth have figured that out, that kryptonite. So today speaks volumes on what is ahead of the Southern Modified Series down here. I'm telling you, we're on to something big. This was a big, big day. And we were able to really kick it off and execute the objective. And uh, we're, we're pretty happy with the outcome here. Before we talk about the significance of this yeah. event, you hit on something. Two kids, 15 years old, Carson Lofton won the first two events, and then the 17-year-old won the King of the Modifieds. You talked about that. The youth has gone wild in the Smart Series. What does that mean? That means that the future is bright for modified racing in general, but definitely down here in the South. What me and Chris Williams has been trying to put together is exactly what is happening. A platform that showcases everybody, top to bottom. And right now, the youth has really grabbed a hold of that. And there is a bunch of good stories that's out there that we'll cover. But uh, today was really a benchmark on what we're trying to do for these guys, for the, all these teams. Third generation of Baldwin in modified racing. Luke Baldwin wins. What do you think of this kid? I think this kid is full of charisma. Uh, gives Carson a hard time anytime he can get a chance to. Definitely today. Um, I think he, he even waved by at him uh, when he passed him. I've I seen it over there. I got the best seat in the house, you know. So, you said uh, that a time or two. Yeah, a time or two. Until I get hit with rubber or asphalt. It sucks. But anyway, I seen Luke. He was he threw out the piece. And, uh, you know, the first person to victory lane was Carson to congratulate him like uh, Luke was for Carson. Uh, so, no, this kid has got a, a just a mom, momentum behind him right now and the uh, success that he's already achieved. I mean, he's, he's labeled the king of modifieds. He can take that and run with it now. He's got a lot to uh, to do next week with Tri-County that's coming up. We'll cover that in a minute. But uh, the talent that this kid's got, he's a he's a Baldwin. He's living up to it right now. I mean, it's, it's a surprise, but then it's not a surprise. He's going to be tough, very tough. So we've talked about the King of the Modifieds, the Crown Jewel event being birthed today at South Boston Speedway. We've talked about the work of everyone on the smart staff. But I want to know not about that work, not kissing each other's butts, honestly, nah. but what does this mean today and what we saw with the King of the Modifieds for Smart? What this means today is going into this, I mean, the only time I got to rest was up there in the flag stand. I, I look forward to getting up there to rest, but uh, the team that, and the efforts and everything that we have been doing for the past four years accumulated today on what we are trying to do. And what we're trying to do is, is say that everyone's welcome here in the smart series and we will showcase you the best way possible the talent in this series is through the roof and we were just wanting to show that you know we're here to stay for a good long time and going into this you know you get the butterflies you get the nervous can we do this not one bit of doubt crossed my mind on the team that we have top to bottom and um, I, again i can put my hat on this event here and walk away pretty proud. South Boston Speedway was the best stage for this. Bar none, the best track to work with dealing with a big event like this. Um, they stayed in contact, the communication was great. What can we do for you? We were doing the same thing, what can we do for you? So everybody helped each other out through this all the way from the beginning of the talks of this last year to this day. I mean, it was constant, constant work. Um, definitely something I can let, you know, put my hat on. Everybody knew the Smart Modified Tour had momentum, but now it's made its mark in terms of big events within the Modified community. Let's switch gears real quick, because you talked about it. Cardinal 99, next Saturday, Tri-County Speedway, Hudson, North Carolina. We had a heck of a show there last oh. year. What do you think is going to transpire this week? This week, <clears throat> Luke Baldwin's gonna come with He's going to be fierce. He's going to be even him. more confident. Look out. <laughs> more confident. I mean, that head, I mean, I don't know if the crown can fit anymore. 
But no, he's got to worry about two people that come to mind. Carson Lofton's one. He's going to come back pissed off. Bobby Miesmer's coming. Oh. Bobby Miesmer last year put on a show there toward the end. I think he got a top five finish. He came from the mid pack and just, I mean, lit a fire, passing everybody left and right. He's coming. Those two right there, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm banking on. They're going to be some entertainment right there. But I say those two, but you can't forget we had a few of them that had some uh, run-ins and stuff tonight, and uh, you know, they're going to be coming to try to get the kid, the, the king, get on top of him. So uh, they don't, they don't like that youth becoming king. I'm telling you. So. They're going, everybody's going to step it up. 17-year-old king. Usually you call them a prince. And, and while Luke Baldwin is a little bit of a prince sometimes around the pit area, yeah. we say that jokingly, of course, he is now the true king, and we can't wait to get he's to Tri-County. He's not prancing around anymore. No. He's, he's walking big, tall. <laughs> he king. is king. Big, king. you know, crown on. But Luke, we love you, and we'll see you at Tri-County.